Let me put an ice cube in here. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers, bud. Sip. Here we go. Oh, wow. That was hot, dude. We're back with Ryan Houdini himself. We're having a quick little breakfast. This is a good way to get started before we do some fishing. Oh, yeah. I don't even know what we're going to do today, but all I know is we're going to get into it. Get thick into some Florida dangling. Maybe some natives, maybe some non natives. Maybe some a little. Invasives. I have a little idea. It's always an adventure with this kid. Stick with us, stay tuned. Let's get him. Hi. I'm here for Hollingsworth. I just got to go pick up their dog real quick. Hollingsworth? What's your last name? Uh. Jeffrey? Can I drive you? Let me see. Oh, dude, that's at the restaurant. Can I, can I turn around? Sure. Thank you. Right. Just keep driving. We're <laughs> 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 going, brother. We finessed the system, brother. We got to get the fish and get it, we uh, it's our second day in Florida. We're getting started off pretty intensely. Um, <laughs> just sped right through the gates of uh, a private golf course, and um, we've got maybe like five minutes before we get kicked out. Like we literally just went right through the gate. Today's mission: do a bit of <laughs> today's mission: do a bit of pond hopping and try not to get arrested. We're with Houdini himself, Ryan Esquerdo, and uh, <laughs> big snakehead. We we're, we're on. A very traditional, semi-sketchy Florida fishing mission. It's day number two here in West Palm, and we're with one of my favorite guys to link up with. Security should be around the corner at any moment, by the way. Let's see if we can get a couple bites. Spot number two. We actually didn't get kicked out of that first spot, but it was a good intro for sure. Were we rolling for that whole? Okay, so you guys got a perspective as what we had to do to get there. No fish, but we're at spot number two right now. Nice little urban spillway. Ryan's just gonna take us on a journey today. This is his turf, and we're just here to experience it. Find on a little tiny jig head with a crappie soft plastic. Anything and everything here, right? Anything and everything. Look for tarpon. Tarpon. Yes, okay. Well, we're still fishing the spillway. Ryan just got a decent little largemouth on a uh, on fly and donated to a, a hungry angler adjacent to us. But no bites for me. Seen some fish roll. Like there could be anything in here, tarpon, snook, largemouth. The boys are just right across the way. Ryan's buddy just pulled up and he's gonna toss me a bait that he thinks is going to work right now. This side. Perfect. That was perfect. Take the what? Oh, f me! I'm sorry. I didn't. See, I didn't see the jig. <laughs> what an idiot! My bad. My bad. Little hair jig. This thing literally catches everything: salmon, trout, saltwater species, freshwater species, smallmouth, lot of hair jig. I don't think there's any small thing here, but it is Florida. Who the f knows? Out of all the no fishing signs that I've ever seen in my entire life, that is the most pathetic. There we go, little peacock. There we go, first fish of the day, an absolute monster peacock. Actually, when they're this small, they're called peepees. I don't know if you knew that or not. This is the first one we've caught while we're down here, so. You're special, little dude. Even though you're not the biggest, you're the first. Oh, hey. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's a decent one. That one's not that bad. That's a decent little peacock. Much bigger than the last one. He hammered it. He came like right next to the bank and crushed it. That's a much better one. <laughs> oh, dude. These peas in the current go a little bit harder than they would in the lake. Oh, that's a solid one, bro. That's a solid one. Solid pee pee on the hair jig. I'll take him all day, see if I can land him. They are such aggressive fish, man. They can sometimes be hard to wrangle. There we go, got him. Decent, bro. Ooh, they go so hard. That's a much better one. Hell yeah, dude, probably about a 
three or four pounder. We graduated from a PP to a full P status. These are the coolest freaking fish on earth. And we are so privileged to actually be able to catch them in the States. They're native to the Amazon. They're native to South America. These fish are many miles away from home, but we still get to catch them and enjoy them. I definitely advocate on releasing these bass. They are actually not a bass, more of a cichlid, but definitely put these guys back. They're here for a purpose and they're so much fun. There's a huge sports, God, they're so hard to hold. There's a huge sports fishing culture revolved around these guys. And uh, me, myself, five years ago, came all the way down from Illinois to catch these. And here we are today doing it again. Look what that fish ate though, little tiny hair jig. Little itty bitty hair jig. Let's get him unhooked, hook nicely. Nice pee, gonna send him on his way. They're so freaking pretty, dude. They are so pretty. Back on water she goes. Nice soft release for this pee pee. Get back down there, you big girl. Wow, that was a solid one. That actually might be one of the biggest I've caught this year. Just out of a roadside canal. There's tons of current ripping through here right now. So you've got a ton of predatory fish posted up in the eddies. You've got, I mean, who knows? Largemouth peacock, snook, tarpon, sharks. Great whites. I don't know anything that wants to eat. Yeah, Caleb's on his head. He thinks, yeah, there's definitely great whites here. Anything that's gonna eat a fish or any sort of bait fish is gonna be down here. We're seeing fish roll, bust. This is the Mecca of life. And it's right next to busy highways, semi truck, people with their catless Honda Civics, all that good stuff. Let's keep going. Well, look how much different this guy looks. He looks way different than that last one. Man, they're so pretty, dude. It's like the most cliche thing to say when you catch a peacock, but it really is true. They're gorgeous. On oh, doubles. Doubles. Oh, that's a largey. That's the weird. It's just the craziest thing ever, man. Largemouth and then peas, bro. They're pretty, dude. They're gorgeous. Do you just want to kiss them sometimes? You ever kiss them? You ever make oh, out? Yeah. Ooh, that's Dude. decent. That's decent. Oh, nice largey. Good busy. Good busy. There we go. Good busy. Literally staying on the same rock that I was on when I caught the peacock, and now I get a green largemouth. As opposed to what color largemouth? I don't know. Blue largemouth? They're all green, aren't they? Decent little fish. On that little Guggen underspin with the uh, dangle dart. It's a solid Ford LMB. We'll take him. Oh, they're fun. Don't fight as hard as the peas, but they're still fun. This is like that game Frogger, but instead of a frog, it's a bunch of idiot guys waving around rods. These little canals are just like, they're freaking insane, man. Like, can't get over how lush Florida is when it comes to fishing opportunities. Like it's really like somebody took a city and built it on top of a marsh and then that marsh is just anything and everything. We got quite a few peacocks, a couple decent largemouth on the spin and all on the small lures which is always fun. The cool thing is when you downsize you open up the opportunity to catch literally anything. You throw big baits obviously you might have a better shot at catching big fish and it's more fun throwing big baits but if you throw something like a little dangle dart like a two inch soft plastic I mean anything from 10 inches all the way up to 100 pounds can smoke your stuff like literally 100 pound fish will eat tiny glass minnows what's the saying it's like elephants eat peanuts same goes for fish fish eat micro stuff but spot number two very solid head to zone number three okay i'll run along it yeah mm. oh big snake that was a big snake. You see out there right on right there? Right on the bank, yeah. Literally, if you can, like, just like that. Oh, Left-handed hook set. That was him. Yeah, why did they do that? Also, why, do I, why did I set the hook left-hand? I guess I would want to take your face off. Also, to the... No, 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 you're fine, you're fine. Oh, that's... What do you think, that was a snake or what? Oh yeah. <laughs> no, I'm being oh, sarcastic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's gone. I believe we just got bit by, um, well, none other than a snakehead. You throw it back? Of course. I can throw 50 yards, bro. You ready? Down. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. Oh, <laughs> let's go. 
Alright, we got a few cool balls. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you ready? Hey, you never seen a spiral this tight. <laughs> we keep going. Come on now. That was horrible. Wait, this you want one of these subscribers? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, we had big fish. <laughs> That's awesome, bro. Yes. Bass. <laughs> Little snake or bass? That's a bass. Uh, shoot. Probably next week. Next week. Maybe. Hit the gritty one more time. Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's awesome, bro. Keep going for snakeheads? Yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm probably just cast around. Just get busy. Is oh it? Oh my god. What do you got? Something big. Something giant. Oh, oh my god. Came off? That was a huge bass. A huge bass, dude. That was a That was monster. We just switched spots. We're at uh, a pond now. Do a little bit of pond dangling. Brian just dumped the biggest bass of his entire life. Oh my god. 11 and a half, 11.69 pounds. We just tried for some snakes, no luck. Did see some, missed a couple opportunities, per usual. So now we're just gonna try to catch some largies. Largies and clown knives and whatever wants to eat, honestly. Just kind of junk fish, it's my favorite. Oh, there we go. I don't know what this is. Yeah. Hey, it's gotta be a bass. No. Oh, sick one. Cichlid. Hell yeah, brother. Another species. Little mind cichlid. On the scout. Ooh, he went a little crazy. We got people mowing their lawns. We got dogs barking. Then we got mind cichlids in Florida eating jerk baits. None of this makes sense. Been kind of slow today, but we have gotten some good fish. We were really trying to go after some very specific and key bites. So we're not getting a ton of numbers, but eventually there at the end, I think we'll, we'll bust it open for you guys. Nice little fish though. They got some chompers, man. I didn't really realize that. It's Thanks for that. Did you get that epic release? That was so sick. Yes, go. Come on. Oh! oh! Giant clown! Giant clown! No oh way. Oh my god! Yes! Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Mega clown on, baby. Oh my god. <laughs> Jake. Oh my god. Guys, Jake is on. Oh, oh. yes! <laughs> oh, dude. We've been casting for so long. Oh my god, what a Let me line up for you. What a thumb. Oh my god. Dude. That's yes. a big one. Definitely. Oh my god. That's a unit, Hell. dude. Oh yeah, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> oh yes. Dude, that thing. <gasps> And it's so hard. I saw your rod, dude. Dude, it's so dude. far out, too. Oh, yeah. Holy Look hell, Look at that clown, bro. That's a good one. Nice job. That's a beautiful fish. waiting game. How long have we been sitting here? Like an oh, hour? Oh, dude, an casting, hour. Casting, casting. An hour casting. Wow. That is so beautiful. Look at the look at the pattern. Hell yeah. Seven spots on one side. Literally an alien fish. <laughs> what full airborne, too. That was the gnarly. That is... These boys have been posted up on this point, casting one and casting one. You want to put him back? No, no, no. You're good. You can put him back. Let's we'll see him swim. Let's we'll see him swim backwards. Yeah. Oh, that was short. Okay, here we go. Oh no, he turned around. Wow. It's the second time I've I've ever seen one of those in person. First time was with Ryan. Second time with Ryan. Ryan and Jacob, we're working this point really hard, doing little tiny swim baits, just casting, casting. I've got ADD, I couldn't stand still, so I'm going around with a jerk bait trying to catch a bass or two, and uh, I look over the point and I see this clown knife just rocket into the air. The boys did it, they hooked up. That right there is definitely one of the more premier, invasive, freshwater fish you can catch in Florida, like period, like everyone wants to catch a clown. It used to be like peacocks were like the premier, but now they're very popular and they're predominant, and these clown knives are making a huge, wake here in uh, freshwater Texas. Freshwater Texas, what the f is wrong with me? Florida freshwater fishing, even though they're not meant to be here, you saw, that was insane. The thing went airborne like five times. Oh, How could you not want to catch one of those? Hey, 
did, just another one? I did, that, that was dumb. We're gonna get one, bro. <laughs> just fast forward, like, it's time. dusk, I swear, any minute now. <laughs> it's pitch black out here. Just keep <laughs> casting, bro. Keep casting. <laughs> That is no him. way. That is him. That is no him. way. Oh, last cast. Last cast. <laughs> Dude, that's amazing. <laughs> yes, he just bone flips it. Oh, yeah, Jesus, those teeth are nuts. Isn't that sick? Yeah. wants to go backwards skirt nice bro yes clowning around with the boys hashtag <laughs> swag baby <laughs> hashtag wp demons we're at the last spot of the day this is this is a, a perfect example of ryan just pulling through he made some calls he had a couple people's lines we got through a gate heavy security armed security we got held up at gunpoint for a while. Oh, yeah. Got interrogated for a couple hours. Had to we're, we're in. Leave some fingerprints. Yeah, what's up, dude? Uh, unfortunately, I uh, I got a couple warrants, so hopefully that doesn't come back. Oh, no. My fingerprints. Anyway, this is a big, bad spot, like Ryan was saying. And we're just going to tear them up. We got like an hour or so left of the day, and we got a storm coming in. It's going to be it's gonna be money. Let's go, dude. Let's, Let's go. go. I got the camera. Oh, wow. Oh, good. Look at this freaking chunk on good Chad, genetics. Bro. Let me give him a little. Forging on Chad. Oh, yeah. It's spank. It was a very nice soft. Shorty little baddie, bro. Yeah. Your boo thing. Oh, it's a nice fish. I haven't found anything. That is some freaking chunk. Just hammering him. You're hammering him, bro. I'm gonna switch to the worm. I'm about to find a Senko. Wait for the Senko and just work it super mm -hmm. slow. That was on. But yeah. I do We're doing pretty good in the soft plastics. Yeah, how many is that for you? That's numero dos, but I had a huge bite that I lost. I actually had two really nice bites that I lost. Okay, all right. I might switch to something on the bottom. They're out there, bro. They're out there. We're looking for that big one, though. That Gertha. Oh, there we go. Ooh, no way. Came off. That was a giant. No freaking way. That was a giant. <laughs> that was a big fish, too. That was an absolute giant. <laughs> it's a, a seven foot nine rod. Just completely torqued me over. I okay. Had, I had two bites like that. They're okay. big ones, dude. That was a that was probably a very large fish, and I just dumped. I don't know how I, I lost him, honestly. That was insane. I gave him the beans. Oh, okay. Little guy. Good one. Little guy. I'll take it, though. I'm on the board. Ryan figured him out. They want the worm. First fish in the new pond, for me at least. Ryan figured out the pattern, man. They're on that Mondo worm. They're on that straight worm bite. He pointed out something very vital to these fish are like built. Very healthy. That is what you want to see. If you get a fish, that is like five times. Oh, I just swallowed a book. Hug. <laughs> no. Damn, bro. I think I just caught a disease now. Oh, if we catch a fish that's like six times this size, that's built like that, it's going to be an absolute behemoth. Good start, though. We'll take him. Bye yeah. bye. Salute you, little fellow. Figured them. So fat, man. Now we're just fat shaming them, huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, I just got absolutely throttled. Oh, Doubles. Doubles. No way. Doubles. Oh, yeah, we figured them out, dude. The big worm. The big worm. <laughs> big worm, little buzz. Nice let's see, one, dude. Let's see who's bigger. Yours is definitely bigger. Get, I think we got twin sisters, bro. I do, yeah. I think she's cuter, though. Yeah, I think she's cuter. She's a little thicker. <laughs> she's got a dump truck. <laughs> nice fish, dude. Cheers. That's sick. Cheers. Send them back. Get the right one. Oh. oh. <laughs> get back down there, buddy. <laughs> he wanted to hang. This is what we're throwing right now. We're throwing two different kinds of big worms by giving the baits. Ryan's throwing the Mondo worm, 10 inch Mondo worm. I'm throwing the nine inch Slim Shake. Very similar baits, a little bit of different action. This one's obviously got a curl tail. This one's just a straight, awesome pond hopping worms. If you come to Florida or anywhere like down south that's got grass, mm -hmm. throw a worm. If you guys wanna check some of these out, they'll be linked down below. Use my code Jombie. Save 10% off your entire order. Just do it. Get out there, get some worms. If you're up north, get some worms for the summer spring bite. If you're down here, south, yeah. make it happen right now. Or add to cart. But don't forget to use the code because you'll save money. Anyway. Keep cranking. I think we fully figured him out now. Figured. I'm getting bit every cast. That's, <laughs> That's him. That's him. I just freaking fell. I don't even know that. <laughs> Are you filming? Yeah. I think I got it. That was the best on earth, dude. We just look over and Adrian's taking a piss. 
<laughs> and you said the hook and he just, dude, that was, oh, oh, that's hurt. No way. No. That's hurt. Yes, dude. That's hurt. That's yeah. hurt. Let's go, baby. Oh my God, what didn't just <laughs> happen, bro? Adrian's, how long is he gonna pee for, bro? <laughs> like, <he's still laughs> Adrian is over there relieving himself in some <laughs> residential bushes. Oh <laughs> I know, it's nothing to say. Ryan's like looking at it, and I'm like laughing, <laughs> looking at it. Sorry, he's got, Adrian's got a name, right? <laughs> it, as in his wiener. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan's over there looking at Adrian, and we're like, oh yeah, he's taking a leak, and he sets the hook. Ryan, <laughs> Look at Adrian, coming. <laughs> Ryan falls over. I set the hook. We got two fish. Yours is fat. Yeah, yours is fat. Damn, thanks. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Slap. Oh yeah. Send him Hold back. On real quick. Adrian's oh, yeah. on pee break. <laughs> I just set hook, literally eight, and uh, here we go. Release. That's double. <laughs> oh, I love Florida bass fishing, man. It's always a good time out here. <laughs> That's gonna be a wrap for me. We're gonna meet you guys back at the uh, at the crib. Thank you, bro, for fishing with me today. Just bring it. In. Actually, let's hug. Let's hug, man. It's been a while, dog. It's it's smell good. While. Smell good too. Smell good too. <laughs> I don't smell good. That's a lie. Mm, not that bad. Yeah. If you guys want to check out Ryan's videos or his perspective today, it'll be linked down below. He just posted a pretty wicked series, fishing Colombia for ten days. Yeah. I'm jealous. I've been out of the country. Jungle Jeopardy. Jungle Jeopardy. I haven't mm -hmm. been. I've been out of the country in like three days or three days. 2023 we international. Yeah, we do. do we it. do. It's been three years since I got out of the country and watching your videos. I was like, damn, I got that itch. I need to scratch <laughs> it. So we'll make that happen. This is a nice warm up though. Coming in his neck of the woods, doing a little bass fishing, clown knife, and of course peacocks. We'll meet you guys back at the Airbnb. He wakes me up and he's like, hey man, it's it's getting pretty bad out there. Are you <laughs> cold? <laughs> yeah, I'm cold. I'm like, okay. So you. Warm Warms up. him up, like like warm up, <laughs> like do something. Like, what do you want me? To, you want me to bear hug you? you? Want me to bear claw you? You know, I'll give you the bear claw. Like, you know, it's all good. And uh, he's like, man, it's just. And he's like, he's like shivering. Oh bro. Jesus Christ! He's like shiv. Like, bro, it's so <laughs> cold. Like, what do you want me to do? Like, I will get naked with you, bro. Back then, so if you want me to, but do not speak about this because it's about the content, right? Dude, I'm trying to go kayaking with him. I'm trying to. <laughs> <get him. laughs> It's gonna be like 70 degrees, and Brent's like, oh, it's kind of cold. <laughs> See, Jacob, I'm freezing over here. Jacob's like, it's 85 degrees. What's wrong yeah, with what's you? Wrong with you? Uh, you look uh, over again, I'm he's fine. butt naked. <laughs> he's like, wait, Brenton, what's going on? <laughs> no, no, like, I'm freezing. It'd be, be nice said, if you could warm me up. They said the sleeping bag was a two person, right? But it was an Ozark. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's Ozark, Ozark Trail Free. Ozark Trail trying to get homies <laughs> intimate out here. Please sponsor.